Good morning, Mayor Joe Yoakum and Council President Tim Salters here for our second yeah. uh, of the week. Second of the week. We're Monday and Thursday now. Monday and Thursday. Uh, really, there's not a lot of news. Which is always good. It's, yeah, exactly. Uh, I think there's what, 22 cases now in Knox County. There was 23. Right. right. We, we, there was some confusion and some conflicting right. reports uh, with the 23 for a period of time. Then Dr. Stewart got that corrected. So we're back right. to 22, 20 recovered, two left. Right. We are in a good, good spot, spot as we have been for the past right. couple of weeks. And we're going to. Mm -hmm. uh, continually hit that point. Another thing too, uh, the mayor and I do get updated information when it kind of shows the counties around us, very low teens or in single digits uh, that they're dealing with around us. So not just Knox County, but all of Southern Indiana is in a really good spot. Yeah, so you know, as long as we keep doing what we're doing, yep. uh, keep these numbers good, uh, we should be in good shape. Uh, I know the businesses, a lot of restaurants open this week. Yep. Uh, Everybody's doing pretty, pretty yeah. well. Everybody's and following the rules. And follow, that, that was the big thing I was curious about too, is how, how is this gonna look? Right. And uh, people were out there supporting our small businesses. They were following the rules and the policies and procedures. Um, I mean, that's that's what we were hoping was gonna happen and it did. And, uh, and as long as we keep doing the social distancing yeah. and good hygiene, uh, recommended you wear a mask if you're out in crowds. Uh, yeah. You know, we'll stay in good shape. Yeah, I mean, it's the thing that we've been talking about since we started this. Wash your hands, keep proper distance, and if you're a crowd that you can't safely socially distance, make sure you wear a mask. Go outside, enjoy being outside, and that's probably one of the better things that we can do. Um, and one of the things I'm excited about, we get to that May 24th deadline, and that's when um, our public parks, we can kind of cut right. down that caution tape and kid, kids can get back out and enjoy right. our play equipment, which that's right. one of the big things I'm excited about. Right. And then uh, I'm looking ahead, we're looking to Options with the pool. Yep. Uh, there are a lot of regulations. Uh, to <laughs> if the pool decides to open. Uh, so we're looking at everything uh, and see where we need to move forward from here. I think the big thing right now is kind of wrapping our minds around the guidelines that they want us to follow. I mean, because they'll tell you, like, hey, you can do this on this day. Um, and then they forget to tell you, hey, here's this list of guidelines and checklists that you have to follow. So. We're looking at that right now, and like the mayor said, we're gonna look at every possible option that we have, we're gonna put it on the table, um, and we're gonna try to figure things out for the best the city events is. Absolutely. I mean, that goes too with other big events that we would see over the right. summer, um, as we're trying to figure out how these guidelines work for the city of Vincennes. So, because we want them to be <laughs> easily used. If we can't follow them, uh, or we can't even explain how to follow them, it's probably not a good idea. So. Uh, we're looking through those every day. Uh, we'll be texting and calling and seeing, is this possible? Can we do this? Um, so we're working hard to make sure that those possibilities are laid out there for you as citizens. Right. And moving forward, uh, what, a week from Monday will be the next council meeting. Again, we'll yep. have it in person. Uh, if you do come, we recommend you watch it live, Facebook Live. But if you do come, you know, get to check and sign in and you have to wear a mask. Yeah. As well as we'll all be wearing yeah. masks. I mean, we did. Temperature check and everything. We follow the same rules. So. And that next meeting will be on a Tuesday because Monday will be Absolutely. Memorial Day. Memorial so, Day. So, um, yeah. So, I mean, it was kind of a different setup. I mean, it was kind of weird to have everybody up here uh, in their masks. We were distance. We've got right in front of us, we've got desks for other council to sit in. Uh, we've spread out the benches throughout City Hall, but it was nice to be able to get back and actually have a meeting. Um, and not awkwardly talk over each other on right. a teleconference. So um, there's a lot of good things that are happening in the city of Vincennes. We've got a new business update section and then uh, the mayor and I kind of go over where we're at in the phases of this plan just to make sure that the council is updated and they know where we're at because in between meetings, like by the time we get to our next meeting, we'll be transitioning from phase two to phase three. Right. So we want to make sure that everybody's up to date with those things because there are some big changes that happened during that time period. But other than that, I mean, Things have been going pretty good. Uh, people are very optimistic. I, I, people have enjoyed being able to get back. To them. I think um, I've seen more people just excited to go, just go to a restaurant again, right. um, and just enjoy that. And and the mayor got a haircut. <laughs> so um, some of those things that we've missed, you're starting to be able to get those things again. And I mean that's just a positive. And again, with these businesses open, uh, restaurants and bars and kitchens, you need to remember that they've been out, they've been employed yes. for. A while now, so uh, it might be nice to uh, tip a little bit here. Yeah. 
And it's not one of those things too, I know like you'll hear the mayor and I always talk about, shop local, buy local, it's, it, that's not just a phrase. I mean, that's gonna have to be something that we just follow strictly uh, to really help us get through this. And I think we're in a really good spot. I think we are poised to make a very strong comeback, uh, but it's gonna take all of us uh, working together to make sure that happens. And I, I think we're gonna do it. Other than that, mayor, it's time for your line. Keep your distance. Have a good one.